Um, I served in the military. I was in the Marine Corps. And um, thank you. Appreciate it. The rest of y'all don't care about your freedom. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, that's fine. No, no, no. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. <laughs> no, I, I did, though. And uh, a lot of people, they asked me like what my experience was. And I will tell you this. Um, I learned some stuff about myself when I was in the Marines. Uh, I learned that I was black first and then a Marine. <laughs> A lot of things let me know that I was black first, right? Like they always try to give us these like rousing speeches to like get us like ready for combat and shit like that. None of that ever worked on me. But what did have me ready for war was when I got out of boot camp and I had that stupid haircut and I went back home and all my black friends roasted me. <laughs> <laughs> I, like I don't know if you've ever been roasted by black people, but it don't stop when you get mad. It stops when your soul leaves your body. You know what I mean? Like that's, <laughs> like, <laughs> if somebody put a gun in my hand, I was ready for war then. You know what I mean? Like I was ready, you know? They also, uh, like in training and stuff, they always try to teach us that, like, uh, you know, if somebody goes down in combat, you're supposed to go out there and get him. I was like, fuck that. <laughs> that sounds stupid. Like, he got fucked up, I gotta go fucked up with him? That's stupid, you know? Like, you know, you'll say, that doesn't even make sense economically. Now you got two soldiers down, you know what I mean? Like, no. like my blackness won't permit that, you know what I'm saying? Like, sorry he grew up in the suburbs and I grew up in the hood, but you know what I mean? Like, that's, like I know how to zig and zag, but that's sorry. sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, you know what I mean? I'll go out there and check on her after the shit's over, you know what I mean? But that's, that's all you're gonna get out of it, you know what I mean? Yeah, man. Uh, the thing that definitely let me know I was black was um, we had this thing when we were in Iraq, uh, uh, we called it called Hearts and Minds, right? Where we had to be uh, nice to the locals there because we didn't want to like get them angry with us and like turn them into future terrorists, right? Because like, you know, when you do that, uh, they put bombs out on the road. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't know if you know anything about bombs, but they're really bad for your knees. You know what I mean? Like, it's not, it's not good for the knees, so. <laughs> we had to be nice to them, right? So sometimes we would have we would have to go and have dinner with them and stuff like that. And I remember one night, we had to go uh, uh, go have dinner with this local leader, right? Because we wanted to get some intel out of them, right? And uh, the Iraqi people are very cool. They're very welcoming people. And I'm, I'm down with that being from the South, you know? But uh, what I'm not down with is the fact that um, in this part of Iraq, they don't use utensils. They eat with their hands, which is, I know it's not. But they also don't use toilet paper. You know what I mean? Like, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. You see where I'm going, you know what I mean? So like, as soon as we walk in the house, there's a buffet, there's a spread, there's like chicken and vegetables and shit like that. I'm like, oh shit, we about to grub. And as soon as I walk in, the head of the house pulls a piece off the chicken and puts it right to my face. I was like, hold on, first of all, <laughs> racist. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I, you know I wanted the chicken, you know what I mean? I mean, I wanted it, but I didn't want it from his hands, you know what I mean? Like, I know, like, I ain't seen no TP rolling around, so I was like, I don't know, you know what I mean? So, <laughs> I'm trying not to be rude, when he put it to my mouth, I'm like, uh-uh. <laughs> and my sergeant was like, Chris, you gotta eat it, you know? And I was like, nigga, no. Like, I'm like, <laughs> and he's like, your heart's to mind. I was like, I don't give a fuck. Like, here's the thing. I know I created at least two terrorists that night, but my, 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 <laughs> Like, no, blackness won't let me eat booty hole chicken. I can't do it. You know, I mean? like, <laughs> you know the funny thing about that story is um, now I eat ass. But like, <laughs> <laughs> like, listen, I didn't back then. I was 19. I was stupid. You know, I didn't know. That, you know? I remember the first time I was eating ass and I had the cheek spread over and I was like, you know what? I could have ate that chicken. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm Chris Mack. Thank you. Guys.